addressing the nation after briefing President Uhuru Kenyatta on the exercise that marks the transition from primary to secondary schools. Professor Magoha said that out of the over one million candidates who sat the examinations between October 29th and October 31st, 50.17 percent were boys and 49.82 percent were girls. The counties with the highest candidates were Nairobi, Kakamega and Nakuru, while the ones with the lowest candidates were Lamu, Isiolo and Samburu. Magoha said that the number of underage candidates increased from 15,747 last year to 20,086 this year. He added that he is impressed with the reduction in the malpractice cases and that those involved were older people and not pupils. I am very proud that I don't have much to write home about in terms of malpractice. There were one or two cases of impersonation, but otherwise our children were left alone to do exams on their own, and the results that you are going to get this afternoon belong to the individuals that own them. The CS father commended parents for helping reduce the number of teenage pregnancies this year, noting that the occurrence of pregnant candidates was significantly lower as compared to last year. And as we move forward, ladies and gentlemen, I hope that this calamity of having very young angels being, preg- being impregnated by hyenas, old hyenas, will stop. Especially if you are able to get the children to take your word as a parent. Overall, Magoha said the performance of the candidates this year was better than last year, a situation that was attributed to teachers doing a wonderful job in attending to learners, especially those from government schools who have shown great effort in keeping up with their counterparts from private schools. It's proved that our free primary education program has come of age and that our teachers are excelling in spite of high enrollment numbers. Each and every year, challenges experienced during the KCPE examinations keep reducing. This year, 100% transitions of pupils who have done their KCPE examinations expected to join different secondary schools across the country. Robi Omondi, K24, Nairobi.